Hello everybody! Another episode of Monday Movie Review. This one is going to be about Pulp Fiction, the Tarantino movie that I only just watched like two days ago from start to finish. And um, it's really good. Um, I like most of the people in the movie. Um, I don't enjoy Tarantino's character in the fucking movie, but I guess you're not supposed to. So, eh? Um, what fucking, what's, what's to say that nobody else hasn't already fucking said about this movie? Um, There's a scene between Sam Jackson and uh, John Travolta where they talk about how a dude got thrown out of a window because he gave a foot massage to Marcellus, uh, Marcellus's wife. And knowing Tarantino... I never really genuine like I don't know if I ever heard about this scene with the whole discussion, but it's basically just it's Tarantino talking about his fetish, really. Uh, con, you know, considering the whole feet thing that he has in his movies, where he just scenes of feet. Uh, and there's scenes in this movie about feet. Um, I didn't realize that this movie, because I've only ever seen like clips, I didn't realize how kind of non-temporal it is. It has like all, you know, um, it's not linear editing. There's like things happen, then you know. We cut to other things and stuff like that. Um, so I thought the scene with the dude getting his head blown off by John Travolta in the car, I thought that took place after the scene in the apartment. Like, immediately. Like, they just take the guy, whatever. I didn't realize there was, like, a whole other section of the movie, and then they come back to that. Um... I, I didn't know that Marcellus wasn't um, the character of uh, uh, I didn't realize that Marcellus was Ving Rhames character's name and not Sam Jackson's character's name because I just I had only ever seen the scene of him like you know when he's talking about like you know does you know what what does Marcellus look like? You know, and does he look like a bitch? Like I thought he was saying that about himself. Um. Then there's the whole MacGuffin thing with the briefcase, which is kind of just I kind of hate it because it's not a, like it's never paid off. It's like referenced, like it's it's shown a couple times, like the golden light, but it's never paid off or like subverted really. Of like it's not that great or it's like this. Um, the weird, the weird racist gimpaver thing is like, <laughs> is this kind of bizarre? Which it's supposed to be fucking weird. Um, I didn't know the scene with the watch because I'd only ever like seen like stills from that scene. I had never like heard the audio from it of like dude keeping a watch in his asshole while being a, being like tortured as a POW, and then like Walken's character smuggles it out of Vietnam to give to the kid 
to kid Bruce Willis. Um, my favorite part of the movie is just Sam Jackson mainly because he's just my favorite actor honestly um, just his delivery is really good um, not to say that the other actors and actresses aren't good I just I like Sam Jackson more than anybody in the movie. Um, so yeah, it's if you haven't seen it, go watch it. Uh, I, I basically I didn't I don't know if I ever really I didn't I don't know if I ruined anything that. <laughs> um. I don't remember how the movie ends, even though I was there, like, through some of the movie, like, I went to get drinks and stuff, because we're watching it in the Discord server, uh, that I think I've mentioned numerous fucking times in this, in these videos, <clears throat> and, like, I left and whatever, and I, but I'm pretty sure I was there for the ending, but I don't fucking remember the ending, um, <laughs> which, that's just my shitty memory, probably, it's, it's not like the, that the ending's forgettable i want to say the ending is the scene at the diner with julius or, or jules and fucking um vince i want to say that's the ending but i don't i legit don't remember um yeah so uh peace out everybody have a wonderful day I, I think Tarantino should really stop making movies, which I think he is, but he maybe should have stopped using the N-word so much in the movies and other racial slurs, because it just kind of feels like he's trying to do it, just to do it. Uh, peace out, everybody. Have a wonderful fucking day.